How about we call it the Wuhan flu or the Chinese flu? If everyone expected that the flu was spreading, this would not be a big deal. Um, but instead, I think because of the exotic sounding name of coronavirus and it's exotic sounding to the average person, there's this freak out mentality that uh, the COVID virus is going to get you. But if it was the Wuhan flu, people would probably be like, eh, I don't know. Maybe it's maybe it's not a big big deal. We have the flu every year. Uh, the flu is continuously going around. But let's look at the stats for flu. And and so far, I don't know how many people have died of uh, the the COVID uh, nineteen. Let's see deaths. Does it say deaths here anywhere? Not many though. Let's look at the the uh, deaths from. Influenza. So um, the number of deaths from influenza averages about 6,500. That's 18 people a day die on average from the flu. 18 people a day. And in America, there's been less than 18 people, I think maybe 10 or 11 people who have died, and it's been attributed to the coronavirus. And, and I've yet to hear of a test that's reliable. Uh, there was someone diagnosed here in Nashville or outside of Nashville of having the coronavirus. And what I heard on the news is that he was diagnosed over the phone by his doctor. Well, how does his doctor know that he has the Wuhan virus, the coronavirus? And let's just call it what it is, the Wuhan flu. Okay. It's a virus, the Wuhan flu. This guy was diagnosed over the phone. So, um, Let's stop freaking out over this and realize more likely the flu is going to get you. Or like in Nashville, 30 people died in a day from a tornado. How many deaths? It's like 50,000 deaths a year from car accidents. So this is a bit of an unreasonable freak out. So don't freak out over the uh, Wuhan virus, the Wuhan flu. It's the Wuhan, or you can call it the CCP flu if you want, the Chinese Communist Party flu, they probably invented it. Yeah, go go ahead and stock up on toilet paper if you can find any now. Fortunately, I stocked up two weeks ago because I knew this was coming. In Nashville, when it snows, everyone runs to the store, freaks out, and they buy milk, toilet paper, and bread.